Hey what's up fellas, it's HM Pikachu here. So this video I'm going to show you on how to do a Mugen portrait um, for a, a specific uh, screen pack called uh, KOF Memorial SE Remake DLC by Super Shadow. Um, uh, if you guys want to see uh, his channel, uh, I'll leave a video video link under vi I'll leave a cha I'll leave a link under a video description below so you guys can go check that out. But uh, I'm gonna show you guys how to uh, do this tutorial uh, thanks to him because he kind of showed me how how to do this and he gave me all the ropes. So here we go. All right, first we're gonna this is gonna be a sample. Okay, you guys can do this all on your own. So we're gonna do this uh, portrait here. Uh, this is a, um, I believe a Kyo, whatever. It's just another Kyo character, but like what? Uh, regardless, um, we're gonna use this portrait as an example. So what you want to do is go to your Photoshop, okay? Like uh, use this rectangle and then select it. But if you wish to do it, if you want to do it another, if you want to do it another way, you could also uh, extract it, like. You could do it like this. You could extract it like so, and then just do this. So either way, well, either way that would, either way that would work. Okay, so you either can do that or you can do the extract button. So either way works. So what you want to do is drag it to here. This night. Dang, freaking computer. What you want to do, is drag is to this uh, template. All this. Okay, all these templates will be available uh, on his uh, screen pack, or I could leave it on the video description below, so you guys can go check that out. But anyway, uh, what you want to do is after after you do that, you want to go to index color, then you go to okay, oh, whoops, okay, go to mode, you go to image, then mode, index colored, merge layers, yes. Then palette exact, uh, force none, uh, transparency. Yeah, you want to check that, and then click OK. Then what you do afterwards is go to color table. Then you highlight every single thing except this last one. Leave that thing blank. Okay. Then what you want to do is pick a color. Well, I think any color is fine. I choose black because it's simple. Um, then what you want then you click OK and then this little if you see this little uh, tool Well, I'm not sure if the mouse would uh, be able to see it, but yeah uh, Hold on Yeah, what you want to do is click that little thing here you click this uh, Highlight it and then you click here then it'll leave that uh, as a blank space then after that you go to your little uh, your little wand tool on your Photoshop, then you click, then you want to just delete all these uh, other color spaces. Then after that, you're pretty much a, uh, well, well, I wouldn't say you're done, but you're pretty much a, uh, you want to do this. After you, after you uh, close every, after you delete everything, makes it look like a white uh, blank background. Then what you want to do is do this, save as, then you go to save as PCX. Okay, this is very, very important. Then you go to you know save it as uh, whatever name you want. Um, I already, I already did a pre. I already did uh, one earlier, so you know it'll be easier. So you save it as a PCX. Make sure it's a PCX. Don't save it as a PNG. That is extreme, extremely important. All right. Then what you want to do is go to uh. So you go to your Photoshop. Well, not your Photoshop. I'm sorry. After that, you, after you finish close uh, saving your work, then what you want to do is go to your Fighter Factory. Uh, any fact, any Fighter Factory version is fine. I use uh, the X64 version. So you go to App PCX. Then go to your PCX file. Uh, what you want to do anyway? What you want to do after is go to uh, save it as Group 9000 then 14 and then hit OK now ignore that white background okay then what you want to do after you save it as uh, save as SSF then op go to your uh, KOF Memorial SP screen pack Let's do this okay then what you want to do is open it
Again, this is just a sample, okay? So, okay, then you got. Then after that, you save that SSF and voila. There you go. You see, it's all, uh, it's all done. So pretty much that's it for this tutorial, guys. If you guys uh, like uh, my YouTube videos and if you guys like the content here, uh, feel free to subscribe to my YouTube channel and hit that uh, little bell button so you know when my next video will be up. And also, you can also catch me on Twitch when I, that's when I'll be uh, do live streaming on my yeah my channel. Occasionally, I'll still do some YouTube streaming as well. You could also, uh, you know, go follow me on Twitter. Follow me on Twitter, you know, to know when my, uh, well, I'm going to be posting a lot there, like basically social media stuff. So if you guys like all, if you guys enjoyed this tutorial, hit that like button. If you don't, also hit that like button. So that's it for this tutorial, guys, and I will see you guys later.